Delete everything, add the cylinder and set the vertices to 64. Scale it vertically and press tab for edit mode. Extrude the vertices of the top face, scale them down and extrude again. You can turn on X-ray mode for better view. Add three loop cuts for the outer side of the mesh. Select these edges and scale them down until you get this ball shape. Extrude and scale down the vertices of the bottom face twice, then extrude once again and move down the face on the z-axis. Create the loop cuts on the inner side too and let's extrude again. Let's create the heat indicator of the pen. One thing left, the grip. Select these vertices and extrude them horizontally. Add loop cuts, then scale them for a more detailed model. Add the subdivision surface modifier, then set the viewport to free. Make your own adjustments for a better result. Extrude these vertices so you get a smoother surface. For the rim, create two loop cuts the way I do. Select the upper loop cut, deselect these vertices in X-ray mode and scale up a bit. And now hopefully you have a frying pan. If you have any questions, please share with me in the comments. Thank you for watching.